every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Sus, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say. Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mox? What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Can you just answer my question? I'm trying to find Evelyn. That's all you need to know. Better start looking then. Black. You seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Joombas killed like a real pro. Caught some lead myself, too. Boo-hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. Do this for fun? Talking around in circles? Trying to make this simple? Just tell me where she is. Why can't you? I don't trust you. That's simple. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Okay, let's just say I'm pretty much fucked. Biochip we clepped during the heist is killing me. I'll be it slowly. Evie commissioned the job. Might know how to stop that. That's why I need to know who hired her. Huh. Let's say I believe you. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. I'd look for her there. And where is that? Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. <laughs> Luxurious. Wait. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. Give you a call. Okay. Thanks. A doll. Thank you, V. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? I see it only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. Aro stop. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Someone's in a great mood. Not every day a half-brained dead chick drags me around a cat house on a wild horde chase. So having a grand old time. Sokka and the Tiger Claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corps leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. You think Judy's lying? Why? Little something called intuition, V. Never heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. So hold on. Take a blow up doll, remodel the hole, and, and that's cheap. That's infidelity. Welcome. 
clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Jack in, please. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Interesting. Is that normal, or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. We hope Sad. you enjoy your stay. Go eat a dip, Johnny. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Valerie. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. V. Just V. Okay, then. V. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. There's 
something in those mirrors way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. You just gonna talk in circles? That it? I can't help you if you don't want to be helped. Oh, what's next? Meditation? Something like that. Try me. Think you know me well. Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. I snuffed it once, and I'm gonna do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. There. Happy. You're scared. Because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased. As if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Death is death is death. You're gone. Game over. You can't know that for certain. Even if you've been there and back. Believe me. I've seen it. And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. What's past is past. I'm over it. You're in denial, don't you see? Would it change things even by a hair if I wasn't? <sighs> so what now? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you. I keep up with everything that's changing. You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Afterlife. What's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? 
I do something wrong? Gotta say, that wasn't what I expected. I was hoping for thrills, not some gloomy, soul-searching debate. Look, baby, I don't decide what happens in here. Your subconscious drives everything. <laughs> Next time, remind me to tell my subconscious to go fuck itself. Um, just don't tell anyone about this, okay? I came here to talk to you, Sky, not some soppy algorithm. Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. Answer the question. Do it. And then you could get back to whatever it is you do. Here's what I don't do. Spill to any rando who walks in here. How about those good looks of yours? Be a shame if they dipped below club standards. I wonder what happens to a doll that suddenly goes ugly. Now, Evelyn Parker, I know you know something. So talk. Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. A customer attacked her? I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Where did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Can I just stand there or tell me a number? Eleven. This booth occupied now? Nah. I think it's been out of order since... Um... Need to get inside that booth somehow. Yeah? And do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See, you turned out to be useful after all. Get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This gonk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir, or we're going to have to escort you outside. Oh, no shortage of wise asses. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. I need to piss first. What will you have? Anything, whatever. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies. Hi. Um, 
think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Relax. You don't need any data, don't need any deeds. I'm not a customer. Here to talk. To you, specifically. Not to be with a doll. Tom, is that it? Uh-huh. Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh, that's what they should be replacing. Got a house special? I'll take it. What do you mean, exactly? Top shelf. Looking to put the edge on, not take it off. It depends what you like. Go with your gut. Surprise me. has a motor uh, can we Clients allowed in here. Bad gear and close the door on the way out, would ya? Or as you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah. You could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho bitch who's never been ghosted by her Bill or Beau before. But go on. I'm listening. You've got info, I've got Eddie's. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy you whores here, not snitches. 
I look like either of those to you. Told you what you looked like. Don't tell me you weren't listening. Surely a reasonable man like yourself wouldn't mistake a donation for a bribe. Real pleasure chatting. But just where exactly do you see this going? Right, we're done here. And I'll be sure to let your bosses know how you treat your customers. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. First off, I highly fucking doubt you know who my boss is. If you did, you wouldn't be calling her my bosses. And on second thought, think I'll take you to my car now. Just to see the look on her face when you tell her whatever it is you make up on the way. She hates lying bitches as much as I do. But we all deserve a laugh, don't we? If I were you, I'd run the cash angle. It's practically written on his face. F-R-A-U-D. Know you've been skimming off this place's till. How much you clup already? What the fuck are you talking about? Talking about the eddies you skim from Cloud's accounts on a weekly basis. Not skimming anything, I'd have to be a fool. Doesn't matter. I'm just curious what the Tiger Claw leadership is gonna think once they find out. Won't think anything because it ain't fucking true. I work with the dolls. Cloud's account's got shit to do with me. You sneaky little bitch. Kudos to you for hatching this one. This conversation's starting to bore me. Humor me, will ya? This particular piece of ass, out of all of them, why? She wasn't even that good. She was hot, I'll give you that. But for all the delusions of grandeur, she was nothing more than a basic whore. And like all basic whores, she got what was coming, as will you. Why don't you just scan the truth from this gray lifeless size, or scour his cup? That just might work. Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a joy toy. Sweat dream.
Tigers, attack! to drop an H-bomb on this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. condition to find help. Decommish before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka. We got a half-century-old score needs settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. <laughs> Listen, honored, I actually. know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need. And Makoshi's how we grab it. You know, you're just an irritating hallucination, right? J just ignore you. And you're you. a walking corpse. Should just wait till your mind shrivels to nothing and frees up space for me. You fucking asshole. But as should be obvious, I've decided to help you. Need to find something first. Seven letters. Starts with an M. Okay, so this... Makoshi. What is it, exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind, 
Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alta Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is. Not yet, but you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside Makoshi. 